Hello again, welcome back. Continuing my Oktoberfest beers. This one is from Hofbrau, one of the big six Munich breweries that brew especially for the Oktoberfest. And this one is just Hofbrau Oktoberfest beer, it's called Münchner Oktoberfest beer. And it is. All in German, the label, so I won't bother. It's 6.3% ABV. I think the IBUs doesn't say it, but it's about 26. So there is a bitterness to it. This is half a litre, 500ml bottle. So let's crack it open. Just the, the traditional branding, beautiful bottle. Let's see what it's like. Lovely gold copper coloured. No gold copper. Let's see if we can get a good pour on this. Hopefully it's not too cold. Yeah, that's it's perfect, but I'll just have to do that looks bra. Let's have a wee look at the colour, yes. Well, it's crystal clear. It is pale straw, straw colour, pale, pale amber maybe. Pale gold, pale gold. It's a beautiful yellowish colour. About an inch of a quite smooth foam-like, foam-like foam. It's definitely foam like foam. I was going to say mousse like foam, tight bubbles. Let's release some aromas. Moderate carbonation. Yeah, a lot of malt you're getting there. Bready malts. There's a wee bit of booziness there too as well. And a very slight hoppiness, citrus. Cheers, my dears. Prost. Oh, yeah. Oh, that, that's all the malt's coming through now. But there's that slight hoppiness as well to it. I think it's many years since I had a bottle of Hofbrau. It's a pub next to where I worked in Newcastle called Beer X. And it was all the bottled beers for all over Europe. I had a great time trying them all out. But so long ago, I've forgotten what they were like. But mostly good. Anyway, let's get the craft beer sheet. The tasting sheet from craftbeer.com. And we'll break it down a little bit. Do the light test first. Just to show you that it's a beautiful pale gold. What does it say on this sheet here? What's that? About a four, something like that. The pale gold, yeah. The clarity is brilliantly clear. It's uh, the colour of foam head retention is pretty poor, up to 15 seconds. It's gone. It is very cold, mind, so. I still kind of get the, the temperature correct in my fridge. The foam texture is thin. Visual carbonation is medium. The aroma alcohol is mild. The hops is a slight citrus. Is there any... I was going to say it's maybe slightly floral, but... The malts, yeah, it's uh, biscuity, bready. The esters, I'll say banana, because it's always banana. The flavour and aftertaste, the alcohol is fairly mild. The hot flavour, very, very slight citrus. The hot bitterness is restrained. The malt flavour is biscuity, bready. Malt sweetness is fairly low, it's not a... Yeah, it's low. 
the astringency is low, the body is drying to soft. Palate carbonation is low to medium. The length, I'm still getting that. But whether it'll last longer than 50, 60 seconds, I doubt it. Medium. Balance of drinkability, desirable style of product. I think I should just always say style. Balance of drinkability is always desirable. So on untap, let's have a look. It's the called Hofbrau Oktoberfest beer. And it's brewed by Startlich Hofbrauhaus München. Who are, oh, this is a microbrewery. I don't think they are. And that's in Munich, Bayern, Germany. Bayern is just what we call Bavaria. The Germans say Bayern. Style guide, it's a fest beer. The, the Munich Beer Festival, or Oktoberfest, is an event of superlatives. It's the largest popular festival in the world, staging in the beer metropolis of Munich. Millions of visitors from all over the world flock along every year to enjoy its very special atmosphere. Millions? I'm not sure about that. For this occasion, Hofbrau brews a rich, full-bodied beer which goes down ideally with traditional Bavarian cuisine. I don't know what that is. Schnitzel and pretzels? I don't know. With its deliciously bitter taste and alcoholic content of 6.3%, Hofbrau Oktoberfest beer is as special as the beer festival itself. The descriptors are smooth, light, malty, sweet, clean. I would go along with that. It is a, a nice, clean, refreshing beer. It smells lovely. Cheers, my dears. It tastes stronger than the other beers that I've had. I'm going to give it an 8.5 out of 10. What were the scores? On? Yeah, I never, I never read that, did I? Um, yeah, I've got two friends check-ins and they've given it an average of 4.13. Everybody else has 125,000 check-ins with an average of 3.6. So 4.13, I've given it 8. Point, that's 8.26, I've given it 8.5. So that's fair. I'm loving Oktoberfest beers. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time, hopefully. Ta-ta for now. Cheers, my dears. Prost. Slightly gassy.